good everybody i'm brandon today i'm doing a video titled the boondocks best moments and then it also says it has 10 honorable mentions so okay we got a whole bunch of moments we about to watch boondocks hilarious y'all said y'all want another boondocks uh reaction so i was like all right let me find a video before i hop into it y'all let me know down in the comments what type of advice video y'all want me to give tomorrow i have a lot of people that slid in my dms and that ask for personal advice i have no problem giving personal advice but I think I kind of want to start off giving general advice that I can help a lot of us men become better. You know what I mean? So let me know down in the comments. I have some people that want me to speak about no fat. Some people that want me to speak about cold showers. I take a cold shower at least three times a week. I have some people that want me to speak about intermittent fasting. I do intermittent fasting every single day. I only eat between 2 and 8 p.m. every single day. So I have a lot of people asking for different uh, topics. So y'all just let me know down in the comments what topics y'all want me to talk about tomorrow. I'll talk about a topic tomorrow, man. Let's hop on into it, though. Boom, that's bitch. What are you doing? I'm writing a letter to Sam. Dear... I mean, this was one of the bus, bus, uh, best you moments. Are a bitch, bitch ass bitch. nigga. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, man. Hold on, hold on. I thought he said bitch ass nigga. Dear... Santa, you are a bitch ass nigga. Yeah. Watch where you walking, nigga. Hey, hey, what you say, nigga? Watch closely. You're about to experience a nigga moment. Webster defines the nigga moment as a moment when ignorance overwhelms the mind of an otherwise logical Negro <laughs> man. What did you say, bitch nigga? Ooh. Hey, squeeze it, nigga. Causing him to act in an illogical, self-destructive manner. <laughs> I like a nigga. Damn. Nigga moments are unpredictable. Hey, wait, man, wait. This is stupid. Hey, you right, dog. Look, let's put the guns away and go on about our business. Freeze. Uh, good afternoon. I'd like to start off by thanking all of you out there uh, who have called and written letters about the safety of the first family. You'll be happy to know that Michelle, Sasha, Malia, myself, and Bo are all fine. Don't nobody care about you, man. Tell us everything will be okay for us. <laughs> everything is going to be okay for us. <laughs> We're currently in our very own super secret underground bunker with enough food and water and entertainment to last several lifetimes. But... I'm here tonight to talk about you. In times of crisis, America's pulled together. And what's going to get us through this difficult Shit, time? we're in crisis right now, Sherry. 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 Lending a helping hand to a neighbor. And the hour of need. No, fuck Facts. a neighbor. What we need is a cure. Unfortunately, there is no cure for the pandemic we now face. But we do have an even more powerful weapon. Compassion for our fellow man. No! Facts! Compassion for our fellow man. You go to prison. The most important thing in your life is going to be booty. Yeah, I better listen to A it. man's butt. Uh -huh. Booty, getting some booty is more important than eating food. It's more important than drinking water. If I see a man I like, I tell him like this here. I like you. And I want you. Okay, we can do this the easy way, or we can do it the hard way. The choice is yours. You ain't taking my booty, nigga. What's it gonna be? We gonna fight to the death. You ain't getting my booty. Question time. Fuck that. Obama did his best to downplay the relationship. Look, I have many, many friends on MySpace. I, I pretty much had anybody. I don't know who this Huey Freeman is, but he doesn't stand for what I stand for. And I denounce, I repudiate, Damn. and condemn him. Damn. Basically, fuck him. <laughs> Obama because he's going to lower my taxes. Actually, he has promised to raise taxes at your income level. Huh? Damn. Well, I also support Obama because he's against corporate bailouts. That is also not true. Huh? I'm supporting Obama because... He black. He black. Thank you, just be honest. And he's going to get the troops out of Afghanistan, right? That is so wrong. Then what the fuck that nigga going to do? Nothing. They took a field slave named Catcher Freeman and turned him into the greatest slave hunter who ever lived. Catcher Freeman retrieved over 700 pieces of human property to their respective owners. Damn it, brothers, you going to stop this right now. Damn. Look at this nigga, bro. Catcher Freeman 
You gotta know a little something about slaves. Catch a now, if you think niggas is worthless and lazy today, oh Lord help me, you should have seen them back in slavery days. Little old master colonel and plantation owners like him. Provided dark and all over the south with good jobs, food, housing. I'm telling you, slavery was the best thing that ever could happen to Negro kind. Okay, first of all, none of that is true. What? Don't trust them little niggas is not a spiritual. Touch your mouth and learn your history, boy. What the fuck? F grade day. You're just mad because your ass is old. Oh, my first thing you do is just pick up the phone. Hey, you know, you know, to you know. living next to your home. <laughs> Motherfucking right. grandpa, old nigga, it's old. Yes. Yes. Motherfucker, lethal interjection versus what? Oh, nigga. He picked up the phone, now my finger's on the trigger. Snitching at the thing to do, so now me and my crew gonna show the block. Fuck him up, Riley. Fuck him up, Riley. Never mind. Damn. Raven has given up several crucial base kicks. Wait, why is he not down to die? Who wrong did this shit? You know it's him. If we win, we're going to go to jail. Hehehehe. So you believe it? Oh damn. Oh shit. Damn. Oh shit. 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 when he had a verbal exchange with his teacher, Joe Petto. But Mr. Petto said it was Riley who used the N-word first. So I told him to take his seat. Nigga, not nigga. I mean, some of the words I've never even heard before, and I was just stunned, and I said, well, sit down, nigga. Nigga, what's wrong with you? You on that stuff? Step out of the tub? Came to hell to go. You don't remember me? You don't remember my name? Nigga. My mama didn't name me. What's my name, nigga? What's my name? Stick me. Ding, 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 ding. That's right, nigga. Mister Dubois. I don't know how you got here, stink meter, but you're going back to hell. Oh yeah, I'm going back, and I'm taking y'all with me in the first class cabin on the Ass Whooping Express. All aboard! Woo hoo! And they fight you just always fucking fire. The fight you see lit, nigga. Stop. 
Think me about him. Think me the fucking about him. Hey bro, great video, hilarious video. Thank y'all so much for requesting it. Boondocks, man. Wait, ain't the Boondocks coming back or some shit like that? Wait, my fuck. Ain't the Boondocks coming back? Wait, is it? Nigga, I don't, I don't fucking remember. Let me know down in the comments. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe. Peace.